What's up, Mix Nutters? It's your boy Marcus and I'm back in black. And today we are going to be doing our St. Patty's Day uh, uh, special and helping you keep sober during the holiday. Coming up next. All right, now before we proceed, go ahead and like and subscribe to the channel. Uh, hit that notification bell so that you are notified every time we drop a video, which is gonna be either Monday and or Friday, of course. And uh, you know what? Hit us with that super like. We all uh, greatly appreciate it. And also check out the Mix Notes friends, all right? These boys are super talented. They're available on all platforms. You can check us out on Instagram. That's that Mix Nuts 3000. Again, that Mix Nuts 3000, run it. All right, everybody. Now it's a holiday special, so you know, uh, St. Patty's Day. I mean, we all love getting wasted, right? But really, I mean, I had to look up a few facts and found this video, and I was like, let's just learn a little bit about St. Patty's Day before we get wasted. I know, I know, but I mean, I promise you, I've been through many St. Patrick's Day and didn't know none of this stuff. So uh, let's go ahead and run that video. So I don't know if you guys had chances to read that video, you know, the little little text that was coming up, but it, man, it was a lot of stuff I did not know about that. Like, first off, the dude changed his name to Patrick after he became a bishop. His real name was Maywin Suckett. Probably pronouncing this wrong, but my last name was Suckett. I wouldn't want to be called like Bishop Suckett. You know, it might put out the wrong kind of vibes there, so I can see why he went with Patrick. You know what I'm saying? It just kind of flows a little bit better. I don't know if I want to be. Yeah, yeah, Suck It's a very unfortunate name. I'm pretty sure Suck It always meant Suck It too. So, you know, maybe it was just a spelling, but either way, you know, here in America, we would definitely call you Suck It, right? So it's S-U-C-C-A-T, which is Suck It, just like real fast, <laughs> basically. You know, if you can't spell, that's exactly how you would spell it. So I see how this guy is uh, uh, moving. And I didn't know March 17th is not his birthday. It's actually the day he died. 
So that's kind of weird and creepy too. But either way, man, let's get down to the nitty gritty, all right? St. Patty's Day is coming up. Uh, stay on your toes, people, all right? If you're dressing up like this or even weirder, in fact, this is when you want to be on your best behavior. Why, you ask? Because if something pops off and you happen to get in trouble because, you know, you was drinking too much and you get in a fight or whatever, you don't want to go to the police station and take a mugshot looking like a Batman villain. You know what I'm saying? Because that uh, mugshots are forever, bro. And uh, everybody's, I mean... It's not gonna be the holiday when somebody discover your mugshot, so you're just gonna be looking super crazy. Same rule applies to Halloween. Actually, same rules apply to anything where you're wearing some weird costume, bro. So, uh, be festive, dress crazy, definitely be on your best behavior, though. The crazier you dress, the better your behavior gotta be because you don't wanna go to jail wearing a top hat. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm just telling you, be cool. Second, whether you're old or young, make sure you're hydrating before you go. Get plenty to eat that day before you go, too. Like, all right, I know everybody want to wait till they cheat day or whatever, but on these holidays, go ahead and consider that a cheat day. Eat food, all right, because you're going to be drinking, all right? These glasses of beer be like this big. I mean, they they, they, they really come with it. Sometimes it be free drinks, you know, little shots. You know, they, they go all out, all right? The little jello shots, everything, they go all out. I mean, most bars in every city go all out. So if you do go out, eat and hydrate hydrate bro and then occasionally as you're drinking i know it sounds like insanity but you know get a water sometimes even if you get another beer like get another beer too but like get a water make sure you stay hydrated because i'm telling you after a hard night of uh hard night of this saint patty's day ooh. You know, I don't care if you got to work tomorrow or if you're just going to be chilling. Because this year, it's on a Friday. But either way, you just want to make sure you're up to snuff. You know what I mean? You don't want to be miserable for like two days, pretty much recovering the whole weekend from Friday. All right? And uh, you know what? Uh, don't be afraid to let that free flag uh, fly a little bit. People are in a way better mood. I love drinking holidays, bro. I mean, it's important to learn what the holiday is really about or whatever. But turns out, I mean, uh, America was the first one to have this holiday. So I thought that was crazy. And, yo, St. Patrick's color was blue, not green. But I'm pretty sure that was for commercial reasons why we did that. But either way, really enjoy it. It's one of the few holidays that is just really about hanging out with people. Everybody being dressed in a the theme and just having a good time. You know, like Christmas, sometimes it gets all wrapped up and commercialized, like commercialized, or you know, same thing with uh, Valentine's Day. So commercial, so showy. This is all about having a good time. I love a good drinking holiday, so we can get it in for the win. And let's see what else we got here. And then, I mean, it's parades going on. There's a lot of stuff to do that day. All right, everybody, the uglier you dress, the better. And you know, you, you know, just just wear a little bit of green so you don't get pinched. But maybe you into that. So, you know what I'm saying? Wear all black or something. I don't know. But either way, man, just drink safely though. You know what I mean? And don't drive, bro. This is if you never use Lyft before, download that shit. My channel is not sponsored by Lyft or Uber, but definitely use that for a holiday like this. All right. And let me remind you, do not believe in yourself. You will not have one or two beers. You will not eat and then wait four hours before driving home. Just scratch that off the list. Take a lift down there, get drunk, take a lift to fuck back home. Don't dry, drink and drive. You don't want that, all right? And even if it's the risk is not enough for you to avoid it, just think about the money. Man, if you get caught, man, the average DUI is like 10 grand. I'm all right, we're talking about legal fees. Not including the time involved in that and then all the hike and insurance rates and stuff. You don't need that in your life. Uh, lift and Uber that shit the fuck up and then go have fun, get back safe, and you know, continue with your life because you do not want to do UI. All right, mixed nuts, that is it for me today. I'm about to make like a baby and head out. If you want to support the channel, go to buymeacoffee.com slash mixed nuts. We got new videos coming every Monday or Friday, of course. Check us out on Instagram. That's that mixed nuts 3000. Again, mixed nuts 3000. And until next time,